We have created a lot of logos together. In this video, I just want to show you the technique of having a box that has two colors, as well as having a beautiful font that you would have imported from a different website. Let's jump in on Canva and create this elegant logo together. What you would do is you would go in on canva.com and create a blank logo canvas. You're going to press T for text and you're going to change your font and make the beautiful font that you would have imported from a different site. So sites like 1001 free fonts and dafont.com, you could download fonts from there which are free and then you would then import them to your Canva provided you have a Canva Pro account. So I've imported this Arizona regular font that I would like us to use as our base of our V that we are creating. So you're gonna type your V, make the size of that V 130. Change the color and make that cream. And then we want now to type the name of the company. So the name, I'm, I'm borrowing this from somebody that borrowed us his beautiful logo that I thought I share with you. So we're gonna press T for text and then we're gonna type the name of the company. Sense font for this one. Whereas with the big V, we're gonna stick with the Arizona, which is a handwriting kind of a font. So we're going to highlight the NCE. We change the color of the highlighted text and color it a different orangey color so that the font has a beautiful kind of a, of a beautiful design that we're busy creating. You would then press L for line so that you can create a line around your logo. I'm going to zoom in so that I'm able to manage my design. You're then going to click on line style and you're going to reduce the line or increase the line to the size that you want. So I'm going to make it a four. I try to be human, find a solution, my evolution. A place like this, it didn't exist, you made it like this. So you can go pick the bad or the good, got a glass halfway. I know. It's easier to hide and just to lay low. Not everyone in life has got a halo. Nice. This way, I'm going to then zoom a little bit back and I'm going to highlight my box and I'm going to group it so that it is all in the same. So let's highlight this section as well. Group it so that the three are one thing. And I'm going to copy that. Control C and then click on my group. Command C and Command V. Rotate that to the other side and then move it so that it is on that other side exactly like that. Then I'm going to click the right hand side. Color that a different color. And my logo is nicely elegant beautifully done and i've imported my font from my free fonts and it looks stunning so what i would then do now is to download it as a transparent background and i go to my favorite website photop.com and in this instance i'm going to use psd templates in order to convert this to a 3d and i'm going to scroll down and look for this mock-up and you would click on the mock-up itself and you wait once it has loaded you're gonna click where it says your logo here and then you would hide the group and you drag your 2d logo and you size it and you're gonna go file save a smart object and you're gonna click on logo mock-up in order for it to convert to 3d and it looks absolutely absolutely stunning and then you're able to export it file export as a png jpeg svg based on what the customer wants and you would share the other files with the customer as well and not just this png 3d that you've created if you have missed that video that i created of how to import fonts to your canva you can click on the link 
above and go watch that video it's going to help you a lot to learn how to import beautiful fonts on canva i will see you on the next video